this till we're clear. When it gets to losers ride. You got it. I hope you got some comfortable shoes, cause you're gonna be walking home. It rides real fast on asphalt, but your car's built for dirt and jumps. You can use that. Best of three? No time, brother. See you around. Hey! I've been robbed! Hey! Harry, I'm inbound with our new bus, but I gotta shake some heat first. We're all waiting for you. Lose the count! Really? Is that the plan?
Johnny, right? You must be Ben. How's it going, bud? I'm sorry. He's uh, shy with new people. <laughs> Me too. Now, Ben, I need you and your mom to strap in tight, okay? We're going on a, a really exciting drive. Stay with me, Alex. I've got Connie and Ben seats on a bus out of state. Why? I'll drive them. Anyone spots you, your cover's blown. This is safe. you and Dayton meet? You think this is a place? Yeah, I bet Ben would like to hear. Oh, yeah, sure. Well, back in Michigan, my dad ran a garage just outside Dearborn. Dayton would come in every single week for parts or a tune-up. <laughs> I couldn't understand how one guy could be so OCD about his car. And one day, I asked him, and he confessed the truth. He wasn't coming in for his car. He was coming to see you? That was what he said anyway. You know how he was. Slick. Exactly. Too bad Ben never got to meet his dad. Dayton would have been a great father. Do you think so? He did a good job with you. Understood. Now you gotta earn your keep. Your first job is B2 down south, Miami. The city has gone all to hell. I need you to pull some flathead control on that situation. I'm on my way. Alex! How do you feel about starting a whole new chapter? What? Where? I've got a solid fix on that tuna. Get to the location on your GPS. Twisting to the right. Usually works for me. Stage three. Is that what they call it? I think that's the star of the street. I can make them pay for that. Not me. I like living. Don't you want to stop running? 
Let's keep the same address for more than two weeks. Go to the deli without making sure you're armed. Help me. I'll make sure you get your life back. You think I want my life back? Or do you really? I want you dead. Only one way to make that happen. Okay, it's cue time. What? I got a place set up. You'll love it. Okay, where the hell are you taking me? Zoe calls it HQ. It's a base of operations. The garage. Who the hell is Zoe? Man, you're making me nervous. Whoa, calm down. Zoe's FBI, okay? The deal is we take down some dirty special agent called Coburn and we get shit. You mean you trust this girl? Yeah, I guess I do. I. This goes south and I'll burn you so good. Deal. Shiv, huh? You got something to ask me? I don't know, maybe start with why? You ever drifted around a blind corner, flat out, foot to the floor? Yeah. Do you think that improved your life expectancy? No. No, but it was exhilarating and dangerous, and you didn't know how it would turn out. So you just clung on, held your line, and you made it by the skin of your teeth. And then, you did it again, right? Yeah. That was life with Shiv. Welcome to the office. What do you think? It's a greasy, noisy cockpit. I love it. Let me tell you how things work around here. The South is no man's land. Parents have been trying to take over for years. A lot of guys have tried, and it didn't end well for them. That fell down to this guy, Cameron Rockford. He doesn't run with any gang, but make no mistake, he rules here. And he's got a lot of muscle trying to stay on his good side. Everyone who knows Cam is afraid of him. You'll have to break that fear. If you can recruit members, take over territory, then maybe, just maybe, you can figure out a way to bring Cam down. Then you'll own the South. 